Azor. From the outside, Awesome Standard begins very well and tries to clear the field, but Sweet on the Ladies has other ideas and goes right with them in the early stages. Taken back third is in some fun. Then moving out on the outside is Knockout Ranger, followed by Epic Drama, then Hidden Journey. Down at the inside, it's Awesome Bay. It's a stretch of another four lengths back to the inside, goes Leverkusen with Brave Rooster on his outside. It's a stretch of three. Second last here is Science to Win, and trailing a long way, Unbridled Holiday. They run around the far turn, Sweet on the Ladies, at the quarter pole with the lead. Awesome Standard is there. Second knockout Ranger is now third. Working between horses, Hidden Journeys in with the chance as they turn for home. It's Sweet on the Ladies who's shaken up and maintains the lead. Awesome Standard is still second. Knockout Ranger is third. Down the outside, here's the run from Hidden Journey. Through the final furlong, Sweet on the Ladies digging in and holding firm. To the outside, Hidden Journey coming on. Hidden Journey at Sweet on the Ladies. It's going to be close. Sweet on the Ladies. Sweet on the ladies held firm and beat Hal Hidden Journey in 59 and 1. In line. And they're off. Thanks God was off awkwardly in his three lengths last. The big favorite, Ink Spired, wins the start with Sweet on the Ladies moving to be second, and Chatamit will back into a good spot, third behind the speed for Edgar Zayas, and four better than Thanks God. They run to the half mile pole, and Sweet on the Ladies now throttles open to lead it by a length and a half. Taken in hand is Ink Spired to be second in front of Chatamit, who's angled to the outside to race a joint third now, as Thanks God moves up on his inside. The opening quarter was just 22 and three. Around the far turn they go. Sweet on the ladies leads it by three parts of a length. Inspired, drawing a bit closer while second at the three furlong point from Chatamit, who's asked to quicken now, racing in third, three behind. The trailer is thanks God as they run to the top of the stretch. Trying to hold sway up top, Sweet on the ladies maintains control. Inspired, working harder to get after him. Second, Chatamit is third as they turn for home. 45 and two for the half mile. Sweet on the ladies cuts the corner and begins to open up. Back to second is Inkspired who cannot find in the final furlong. Chatamit trying to catch him for second, but Sweet on the Ladies is fleeing the scene. It's Sweet on the Ladies and Jockey Marcos Manessas to win at gate to wire by three. Chatamit got up for second, Inkspired third, and thanks God wound up last in 110 and two. line all set for the juvenile sprint and they're off slow start for red crescent stormy my way breaks out well and stormy my way right out to the front but here comes two steps before two steps before now with the head in front cinderella el chrome is hard set at the rail as well as those two will now duel for that lead stormy my way backed off of that pressure now sits in the third spot about four lengths off those dueling leaders red crescent after the slow start is moving up in the fourth spot Red Cotton is in fifth, then behind that is Sweet on the Ladies, followed by Thanks God, who trails the field as they move to the far turn. Pace duel on the front end. Cinderella El Chrome on the inside, two steps before, right on the outside, two steps before, maybe a head in front. Storming My Way is watching that action from the third spot, moving up Red Crescent, trying to move up with that runner as well. Gap of another six. Back to Red Cotton, Sweet on the Ladies trying to run on. Quarter mile left to go. Two steps before and Cinderella El Chrome have now been swallowed up by Red Crescent and Stormy My Way. Red Crescent up on the outside of Stormy My Way. Here comes run from the outside of Sweet on the Ladies. And Sweet on the Ladies is making up a lot of ground and running right by the field. Red Crescent back to second, Stormy My Way running on. But it's going to be Sweet on the Ladies off the pace to win. Stormy My Way finished second. Red Crescent finished third. They're in the gate. Racing in the Crystal River Stakes. 
per the inside extravagant kid was away well brandy's girl is fired up to take the lead up on the outside sweet on the ladies is now third and french quarter is last of the four under montavo out there tapping on the brakes extravagant kid and he'll be a joint last as french quarter also had to get out of there as they swing around the far turn Gaffleone has the engine here with Brandy's girl in front, three parts of a length. Sweet on the ladies. Move to the leader while second. Extravagant Kid and French Quarter will both have stretch opportunities through a 22 and 3 opening quarter. There's less than five sixteenths to run. And on the outside, Sweet on the ladies. Trying to spring the upset, has the lead. Brandy's girl tries to stay on. From third, it's French Quarter. Extravagant Kid gets a crack of the crop to try to make some ground. All four in with a chance. Three sixteenths to go. It's Sweet on the ladies who has the lead. Toward the inside, Extravagant Kid over the top in French Quarter with Brandy's girl. Final 16th. French Quarter's coming after Sweet on the ladies. Extravagant Kid is at the rail. It's going to be Sweet on the ladies to spring the upset. French Quarter second. Extravagant Kid third. Then Brandy's girl in 57 and